one way or another, we're going up to Syria A today, my friends. And I've taken a look at the squad registration rules. Let's go check that out. We're, we're planning. Wait, this is good. We're planning in advance. All right, my friends, welcome, man. Thanks for your support on the same. I am blown away that we are getting <laughs> promoted. Remember when we were supposed to be down here with Sasania? What happened with that? Um, but I, I said to myself, okay, we know the squad registration rules here were different than City of Chi. How different is City of Ah? All right. First thing that you notice. Okay, under 22 players automatically eligible to play in all matches. So it's not under 23. It's weird that it moves because I feel like let's just check. Yeah, under 23 here. That's just odd to me that it's like pick a number. Just pick a number. Um, 12 subs name, three use, same as Syria Bay. Nice. Uh, VAR, goal line technology, some extra things here from, um, you know, how long the bands are if you keep picking up yellows, which might mean we take the ball winning midfielder out of the equation. Um, 60 million divided between the relegated teams based on number of recent seasons they spent in this division. That seems like an interesting thing to me, right? So like if you go up and go down, do you get a million and the team that had been up here for 15 years gets 59 million or something like that? I'm not sure how that works. This is where it gets interesting. So you have to have a minimum. I'm going to scroll this up so you can see it. Not behind my head. Minimum of four players trained at the club for three years, regardless of their loan spells away from the club. I don't know if that means like if they were at the club and you loaned them, is that still okay? Between the 15th and 21st birthdays. Minimum of eight players trained in the same nation. We're fine there. Um, and then when you can register, like you can replace a goalkeeper with another goalkeeper outside of the registration window. You can replace a player who agreed mutual termination of his contract outside the registration. So if someone's like, I'm not getting play time, mutually terminates contract, you can sign somebody and bring them in, which is interesting. You can replace two outfield players once per season outside the registration window. Okay, so outside of the goalkeeper, you can do two more. Uh, players sign on a free can register at any time. So again, if you don't have your maximum squad size of 25, you could pick up somebody on a free is what I'm reading there. Um, and then obviously this is where it gets really hairy with non-EU players. So the first thing you say is like, well, just don't sign any non-EU players, right? Uh, if the club has three more non-EU players in the squad on June 30th of each season. So what is that? The, like the day before the season kicks over? including those soon to be out of contract, but excluding those out on loan, they can only sign and register up to two new non-EU players to play in official matches the following season. Okay, so if you've got, even if you've got them, they're, they're going to expire on June 30th. Even if they expired, you can only sign two new non-EU players. One can be signed without the need to replace a player, but only if the players played at least five national team matches including under 21 if the player's under 21, blah, 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 or has been called up at least twice for a national team in the last season. Okay, so they have to be like a really good international non-EU player. One can be signed should one of the non-EU players contracted to the club leave to a foreign club, see their contract expire terminated, gain an EEA nationality. Okay. So if you have three, you can sign two, but one of them has to be amazing internationally and one can replace one of the ones that would be expiring if you only have two this is like unbelievable if you only have two non-eu players including those the blah 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 you can sign a register up to two new non-eu players one who's who is subject to no restrictions to bring you to three k and one who can only be signed if a non-eu player either leaves or foreign team sees the contract or gains an eea nationality um okay and you only, if you only have one or none, then you can sign. If you have one or none, you can sign a register up to three non-EU players to play in official matches with no restrictions. That would give you four, wouldn't it? I was so good with this. I mean, I feel like I understand. If you've got three, you can only bring in two, and one of them has to be really good internationally. I guess that would be to bring you up to four if the other three stayed. And the other one could be to replace one of the other ones. So you'd still have four. Okay, so maybe that's what it is. I thought the, I thought the max was three, but apparently it's four. And if you have 
two Nani. Okay, yeah, right, right. I, how many really good non-EU prospects are we going to find, at least in our first season? Probably not many, but oh, I know this has been troublesome for some content creator. I know Loki at one point, what, what was his Lazio save a while back? It was like unbelievably complicated. The, the thing I'm more concerned about, to be honest with you, is a minimum of four players trained at the club for three years. Um, when you come here and look at our squad here, <laughs> ooh, we got a bunch of trained nation. That's not a problem. You, you know, we don't have like an, a massive amount of non-Italians, right? We've got a Belgian goalkeeper. We've got a Swiss, a Swiss uh, midfielder, a, an Irish striker, a Belgian striker, and a Spanish backup goalkeeper, and then a Croatian starting striker right everybody else is on loan or gone or whatever so we're fine there but in our current senior team i guess i was gonna say starting whatever 23 but in the senior team we've got flacovio from the club barba from the club congratulations barba you're staying around and uh, santa polo who is i guess going to be sticking around i'm not sure how we're gonna juggle that because we have to have four okay so even if santa polo stays which is kind of gutting because I was really hoping we could loan him out. Does that mean we, we loan him this guy out instead? Uh, even if we had four, we have to come into our under-20s and start picking some people, right? So, um, training at club is down here. So, we got Tom Tom Schradel is the natural choice. He would be, if we kept Santa, uh, Santa Polo, that he would be our fourth. Um, hey... After that, it's a little iffy, just in turn like we have some that are about to, but it's not like they're amazing talents either. Um, so Tom's probably gonna move up. We're probably gonna be stuck keeping Santa Polo, which I really am disappointed by because I was thinking we were gonna loan him out. Does that mean we have to get rid of Paul here? He's worth 135k and make Santa Polo, even though I don't think he's necessarily ready, make him the cup goalkeeper. What are your thoughts there? That is suddenly very, very concerning. And obviously, we can we can come down here to the under-18s, but again, like, let me just go back to our normal selection. It's, it, you know, Dustin Kraus, yeah, yeah, who just got signed. He's not ready to, to play a game in City A. Ah, just isn't. Here's Al Capone, by the way. There he is. Enjoy. Enjoy. So... I, that, I, we're going to play the game today, I promise. But I, I just wanted to... I'm, I was thinking through those types of things. So I've, I've already already offered a contract to Barba to keep him around. Um, Brodich went out. Uh, he's got a groin straight for three weeks. He's going to miss the last game of the season. Um, I was thinking Zimbardi, but apparently Zimbardi... I forgot. We, we signed him on a free. So he's not even going to... You know, I was thinking, hey, he's not amazing, but he's not terrible. He could be a decent, you know fourth striker for us um because scapini is gonna go away but he's not homegrown club oh it's so bad so i feel like we've done a decent job with planning the squad out for next season right like it's not like our entire team here is uh about to expire but i think we could have done better so we need to make a decision on mario de marino <clears throat> he's had seven starts four subs on a 703 has a little bit more upside potential. His current has dropped off as as the rest of the squad has gotten better. He's on contract with Venezia uh, for another year. I don't think we could buy him. He's worth two ten. I don't know if I want to buy him because right now, right, we're paying eight seventy five a week. That's a bargain because his contract. I mean, sure, can we extend that? I'll probably lean towards that. Um, even though we have Moretti that's coming up just to give us a little bit more depth. What's the, okay. He's worth 210. They want 475 to 775. Right. I think we'll wait for the end of contract. Cause that's what we do. We've signed a Cardi. We just offered a bar by contract. I need to decide on Cortezzi. I think I like Cortezzi enough, even though he's only had eight subs on a 6.6 .6, to maybe do a one year extension and then try and loan him out. It does say he's a good player for most city of Chi teams, which, and only has, you know, potential to be a leading city. It's just like, really? Really? Maybe we just drastically overperformed in City of Bay. Um, Favelli, uh, so on the fence with Favelli. Just hasn't, I mean, 
again, we've only given him three starts and 13 subs, but just hasn't really developed. Um, Nichetti, we're probably going to extend to just give us some more depth in the midfield. Again, he's theoretically our fourth best midfielder. Romano dropping off a little bit. But what's interesting, right? Oh, sorry. Um, leading player for most city of cheese sides. And I'm like, he's got potential to be a good city of Bay midfielder. So he's got potential to develop. Again, he's got a star and a half to go. It just seems like, have we walked into a disaster where we're getting promoted too soon? Like, I, it kind of feels like that. And then Brosco, I'm just... Decent player from a city of Bay sides. He's on a 697. Is it worth keeping him around? I mean, if he would take a... I mean, he's going to want a massive contract, I think. I don't think he's going to want a one-year extension, and I'm a little worried about this. Like, I'd much rather... He's 31. He's going to be 32 in the middle of next season. I'd much rather find, like a 27 year old to bring in for something like that. But when you look at it, right? Like Favelli's a backup. Brosco's a current starter. Okay. Scapini is going to leave. And Mario is a rotation player. So we got a Cardi as the, and Brosco as the only starters that we have would have had to make decisions on, but a Cardi is joining us. Right. So it really just comes down to Brosco and the rest are rotational backup youth prospects, whatever. So, I think we've done a good job there. Now, next season, it, they're kind of spaced out, right? We got some 2025s, some 2024s, some 2023s, and then this group of 2022. So that maybe that's something. I don't know if that helps you when you're doing your saves. Is like try and stagger that out. Try and if you got a player on a good run, try and extend them like we have with Casty and Roberts, um, stuff like that. So, with all that being said, my friends, we're gonna hop forward um, and play uh, Ascoli again. I think we can. Unless they just absolutely hammer us and spall, who are they playing? They're playing fifteenth. They could they could get a, a huge win here. I guess they they well the last time they played they beat them one 0 so maybe not. Um, so there is a chance I guess that they could hop us from a goal differential and goal score and all that kind of standpoint. But if unless I'm remembering the rules wrong, it's it's a, a similar results and we beat them and they beat us. So it comes down to all the other things that we currently lead in. So let's go find out. All right, my friends. All we need is at least a draw. I think even with a loss, we're still going to win the title. But I'm, because it hasn't like clicked over yet, I'm still <laughs> like a tad nervous about that. So we're going to go with our best squad. C DVV up top with Cassie switching sides. Haas, Romano, Rossi, Labuti, Zambatoro, Vibes, Dosenia, Brosco, and Zvus. Zvus. They're in sixth, okay? It said we're like, what, four to seven odds to win? Like, come on. Let's go. There you go. There you go. I, I had another team talk about, because we didn't get it done last time, um, and it was like, listen, we're one point away. Go out and play your natural game. Everybody liked that one compared to the previous team talk, except for Scapini, who was like, come on. I'm like, well, you're about to leave anyway. Um... Uh, right, 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 right. Come on, boys. Like, can we, can we please just win? I don't want to, I don't want to like, oh, that was really, like, there wasn't any curve on that. That was interesting. Um, I, I don't want to stumble into Serie A, right? Like, I want to finish the season on a high note. Oh, well. Oh, it looked like it might have been an own goal there, but full full knot is on the case. I think that might have been a back pass. I think that that should have been a <laughs> uh whatever is it a, a indirect free kick free kick from the spot like inside the six yard box. Come on, boys! We get twenty nine percent possession. They are dominating. <laughs> we got them right where we want them, boys. Or did I? Oh, we st still got the standard line. Yep, still do. It's not a it's not a low line. We are playing like garbage. Yeah, I'm gonna let you know. We're trying to win the title. The tie the the hold on, let's do a halftime update. They're drawing currently. <laughs> Come on, boys. Cassie's kind of just Fallen. I mean, oh, Labuti's on a six point one. If, 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 you know, 
You know, 6.2 is still pretty bad. Flacovio. We're trying to develop Flacovio. He's coming on. Get creative, lads. I mean, a draw does it, to be fair. All right. Cassie's nervous. We're going to see Scapini one last time. Give him a chance to run out with the lads as a pressing forward, even though he's getting up there in age. All right. He comes on. Rossi. Dosanio. Oh, he's there. He's there. <sighs> Full Nati, okay? Okay, we, we get him right where we want him, boys. He's waving his team on. Or forward, I should say. Flacovio heads that down to Romano. That's a lot of fun to say. Romano is like, I'm going to prove I can make it next season. I'm going to prove I can make it next season. DVB! Oh, it's saved again. Another massive save from the keeper. At least we're getting stuff on frame now. Um, Oh, Flacovio is... Nervous. It's it's great. It's great. Romano, not really doing himself any favors. I guess we'll bring on a Cardi. And put Rossi. He's got the best, you know, uh, playmaking ability of the bunch. Come on, boys. I mean, yay! Yeah, but... Two losses, what is it, two losses and a draw to finish the season? I mean, we won the title, right? But, I mean, I know they're in sixth. I, I'm just, yeah, what, what, you, as much as I'm disappointed, you can't be like, you're terrible. Like, that's not how you want to go into the offseason. So it's like, hey, we won the title, congrats. And they drew, apparently. Yes, one to one. And a man sent off in the 94th minute. We've won the title. Like, I uh, I want to be more excited. I'm more scared, I think. Now, obviously, okay, so not two losses and a draw. A loss and a draw. But we got the job done. We went undefeated in April with, what is that, the six games? Quite a lot. Um, so we, we got it done. We got it done. They asked me if I thought my our September run, um, you know, sealed the season for us. And I'm kind of like, well, you could argue, aside from the friendly – it was the August to October 16th run, or really the first half of the season. You know, like, what is that? We lost one, two, three, three games in the in the league. We lost a, a cup game, obviously, but that's freaking amazing. That's freaking amazing. So the fact that how many did we lose total? Seven total, four in the second half of the season, three in the first half of the season. Um... Let's look here. That's solid. That's solid. I mean, that's solid. We won the. We won. <laughs> I'm still waiting on a contract extension. I'm just saying. All right. So Brescia, Perugia, Cittadella, Ascoli, Benevento, and Sassuolo have guaranteed themselves a spot in the playoffs. Scapi Gola Scapini worries. Yeah. I mean, it kind of it kind of is what it is. He's not like a... Is he a club player? No, he surely can't be. I mean, 16 goals and 15 goals. Not bad in City of Chi. And then it was just age. It was just age. And I would like to keep him as a staff, but he's not a director of football. He's not even like an under-18 manager. He's not even really like a coach. I mean, we could sign him as a coach and have him develop but it's he's spirited rather than like resolute so i'm just gonna say hey man thanks for coming yeah club favorite mirko stefani played here for six years national b is in disbelief i mean based on the season or the whatever the uh the season preview, that would be fair. It says this is the second time we went 92 93. That's right, because we went, we went up to Serie A and then and that was it. Um, there you go. Zolfs. Yes. Yes, lads. Yes. <laughs> That's unbelievable. Oh, you must play in at least one match to get a, a, a Serie A Bay medal. So, Mattia Carta, who, have we, yeah, we've offered a contract extension, because he has, he, he could, uh, he could go on a loan. I'm trying, we're trying to 
develop players to sell. So anybody else that's kind of hilarious? I mean, Paul did play in two league games, so that's why I bet he's happy because that'd be really disappointing if you're the backup cup goalkeeper and you do the cup games, but you never got into a league game and, and your team wins the league and they don't give you anything for it. That's kind of harsh, isn't it? Um, but maybe maybe it's for the whole season, but I would, I would imagine that means one City of Bay match. Anyway, um, anybody else that's kind of surprising? Uh, Tartaglione with the one sub gets in there, gets to put it on his man uh, mantle. Um, Favelli, Labuti, yeah, everybody else is is the norm. Is the norm. Um, get away from my goalkeeper. Two point five million. What do we do with it? Oh, we do nothing. Seven hundred eighty-two grand. That's it. We were what? Oh. It's like, yay. I mean, I'm glad, right? Like, w remember when we started the save? We were at like 1.25 million. So we're, we've, we've won two titles and we're, we're less than that, but we've, we've nicked it a little bit and they've upped our wage budget. We are massively going to need sponsors. That's the only, I'm, I'm sure there's some TV money and all that kind of stuff, but we are going to need a massive amount of help because what I would love, and I don't think they're going to, they're going to go for it is. We've got to up, I think, our youth facilities or our training facilities or even our youth recruitment or coaching. I, I would take anything, to be honest with you. They've been really open about um, getting our staff uh, licenses. I'm sure there's a screen that I can see that. There, there's a screen that pops up when when they go to get a license. It shows all the licenses. But I've been able to get my Continental Pro, Renato here, our assistant manager, that is still working for free. Um, you know, like they they've been open to doing that. That is unbelievable. All right, this is your last chance. Who? Or no, not no, no, no. It's not your last chance. No, I'm 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 befuddled. Um, I'm gonna leave this up here. We'll kind of we'll kind of go through it a little bit, and then obviously next episode will be the transfer window, <laughs> um, and the end of season awards, commercial summary, all that kind of stuff. So, who do you think our player of the season is? Right here, are your options in terms of average rating across all the games. Now, Mario is only on. I, I don't think you're going to choose Mario. I'm just pointing out the number of games. Same thing with Zanini. Um, number of goals, Cassidy with 17. With five assists. Rossi was 13 assists. Not bad. Brodich with 11 assists. Started really hot and then it kind of tailed off, right? He was at 1.27 games with nine goals. And then he gets to 34. He gets two more goals. Or is that... He gets one more goal in the league. So... But I... I please don't sell him. Please don't sell him. It'd be terrible if they were like, hey, we're really trying to stay up. So, like, let's just go all youth cut our wage budget down and sell our best players. That'd not be good. That'd be very, very bad. And then the assist leader is Rossi as noted. Um, but that's, that's where we're at friends. Um, I'll show you the, the signings. Um, obviously these won't count for this season, signing of the seasons and all that kind of stuff, but there you go. You can, I think if I don't move my head, you can see what's going on here. So who is the signing of the season, young player of the season, um, all that kind of stuff. Either be thinking about it or go ahead and, you know, put your thoughts in the comments below. Hit the like. I think I think that deserves likes, personally. Um, really, I think watch time is the most important thing. So if you've made it this far, um, freaking congrats. That's awesome. Um, I'll see you next time. Can we find a replace? I, I think this guy is just not going to cut. He's just not going to cut it. He's just not. you got a great smile, too. It just... Kappa. Um, I just not thrilled, not thrilled with this performance, even with five goals to assist on a six, eight, four, just not, not feeling it. All right, my friends, can we stay? This is the last thing. Can we stay up next season? I think we may have been promoted too soon. Not that I'm complaining. It just seems a little iffy. Let me know what your thoughts are. We'll see you then.